Hey everybody, just a uh, quick demo to show you the new um, time tracking capabilities in uh, the Dataset QSO database. So back in the day, like four days ago, when we recorded a QSO video, the only place to really watch time was up here. Uh, but you'll now notice that down here we are doing uh, per minute time. Um, and when a QSO comes up, we get a little label uh, for each new QSO as well. And then we can scan back and forth through the map. We get per minute, we get new QSOs, um, and we can make kind of cool uh, QSO map movies, although this one's a little bit boring right now because there was definitely a gap in this portion of the POTA. So the next thing to talk about is how it was implemented. And the idea there was to use data set, um, we pull in the usual rows of, of where the transmit and receive stations are. Um, everything else is the same as it's always been before. And then there's just one, two extra additions. Um, for each QSO, we had a screen overlay. And this is all in the Git repository. But we're using the uh, bubble eye context from the old Google chart API, which is yet to completely disappear. And that's how we're getting this information here. Um, and, and so there's some KML there. You have to look at how screen overlays work. Um, I'm doing fractional uh, placement of the, of the bubble icons. And that's why you see, you know, clearly zero is down here for Y. Uh, zero is over here for X. And that's 0.6 across the screen. Okay, then the second part, the way we're updating per minute is here with this screen overlay. And what I've done is passed in the number of minutes that, well, actually a list of the number of minutes that the map lasts for. And so then I put in a screen overlay once per minute. Um, both of the screen overlays have a draw order in them and they use the loop index. And that's what makes a new screen overlay or a new time pop up over the old time. That's how it animates. Um, but with Jinja using data set, it was really easy just to have it do, once I learned how to do a, a for loop in Jinja, it was really easy to have it put in the per minute timestamps as well. And so I'll leave you back with the, uh, with the map running for just a little bit. We'll uh, turn on time. Um, and we will watch the sun come up with QSOs. That's all, guys. See you after a while. It's Katie Zero FNR.